players don't arrive until tomorrow night. They don't start practicing until Thursday, but the front office has been at work for weeks preparing for another season at Centene. Brett Kennedy caught up with the staff ahead of Friday's opening night. The minor league baseball season is almost upon us. As we count down the days to the Voyagers letting it rip on the diamond, the entire staff at Centene Stadium is hard at work, busily preparing for opening day on Friday the 15th. Final touches, you know, what can we do to get, get the food all set up? What are we doing around the field? Make sure everything looks as pristine as possible so we're ready to kick off summer officially on Friday night. Our main priority is probably getting the ballpark ready. Um, there's a lot to do. We wanted to make sure it's as presentable as possible for opening night. Um, and then just getting uh, so many people are coming in to buy tickets. Um, me personally, I'm getting ready for all my nonprofit groups. Uh, Americans Little League is our nonprofit of the night on Friday, and they've sold so many tickets, so just getting them ready for the night. Of course, one of the biggest attractions at baseball games is the food. This year, fans at Voyager's games will see very different things on the menu, like the specialty made Voyager burger and new dips for your hot dogs. There will also be new food stands this year, like the one from Teriyaki Madness. We switched up the macaroni recipe and it's gonna be amazing. It'll be in third base to top your dog. And we also have buffalo chicken dip now and that's gonna be really good. I'm excited because I, I kind of tweaked that recipe myself. And then the chili's coming back and that's Scott's famous recipe, so that'll be great. The sales for 50-50 this season will be helping a different nonprofit organization each game. And there's a unique way to participate in it this year. Brand new exciting things are coming to game day experiences this season. We have a new electronic 50-50 sales, the first venue in the state of Montana to do that. So you can pay with a credit card for 50-50. Unchartered territories here, and we couldn't be more excited to help raise a ton of money. Our goal is to raise over $50,000 in cash donations for local nonprofits this year. We're also going to have great post-game fireworks, um, great giveaways. We have our magnet schedule giveaway, um, our wood nickel giveaway, um, and then just great atmosphere. You know, Friday night is a great night for an opening night. Um, we've haven't had baseball for a little bit, so it'll be fun to have baseball back Great Falls. Getting excited and hungry for baseball season. Brett Kennedy, MTN Sports. Well, thank you, Brett. Opening night means post-game fireworks at Centene Stadium. The White Sox still finalizing their minor league rosters. We'll hope to have a few updates for you tomorrow in sports. Their media day set for Thursday afternoon at their first practice. We'll be right back.